the universe has infinite power, he can control all, everything in the world cannot be separated from him, including you and I are no exception. This force is called the law of attraction, the universe can give you everything you can't imagine. If you want to use this power to change your life, let it bring you wealth, happiness, health, positivity, optimism, hope, love and so on. Watch Change Your Life Action, the YouTube channel, which allows you to get everything you want, watch immediately. Remember to subscribe to YouTube channel. It's best to click on this bell-shaped icon, so that you're the first to receive a new video. It can make a perfect change in your life. Let's start watching now, today's title is What is cellular memory? 8 signs of a past life connection. Have you ever had the uncanny sense that you've lived before? Or, maybe you've heard amazing past life stories about people who have recovered memories from a previous existence? If so, you've probably wondered about the idea of rebirth and wondered how you might be able to learn about your own. The concept of a past life and cellular memory has been around for at least 3000 years. This is long enough to give us good reason to believe that there's something to the idea. But how can you investigate your soul's history in a sound, thorough way that helps you distinguish between memory and mere imagination? If you want to understand past lives and figure out whether you've had one, or even how many you've had, it's well worth learning about the concept of cellular memory. In this guide, we'll explore the nature of this special kind of memory. Also, let's consider the key physical, mental and emotional signs that you've had previous lives. What is cellular memory? In a nutshell, the theory of cellular memory suggests that it isn't only the brain that is capable of storing and recalling experiences. Rather, the body itself can hold memories. These memories can have a powerful subconscious influence on our desires, needs, and responses to things in our world. Experts who study past lives often believe that it is our cellular memory that stores data about our previous selves. That's why we need to take a different approach in order to access this information. Simply sitting and reflecting is unlikely to allow us to tap into our cellular memory, but other methods can. 8 Signs of a Past Life when you think about past lives, you might imagine a dramatic kind of past life regression in which you suddenly talk with a new accent or find yourself with a different skill. In reality, most past life stories unfold in a more subtle, but nonetheless thrilling, way. The following eight signs of past life experience can help you understand your soul's history. These can provide you with a new outlook on who you are and what you want from the world. As we look at each sign, we'll consider how you can promote the discovery of more memories from your past lives. So keep reading to discover how cellular memory theory could present itself in the physical world. 1. Deja Vu Deja Vu is that strange, suddenly feeling you get when you are struck by a sense that you have done, heard or felt something before. It can be elicited by everything from a person's face to a smell, a taste or visiting a new place you don't ever remember visiting in this life. Any time you have this feeling, it's a clue to the type of past life you may have lived. The feeling of deja vu can be deeply frustrating because it is often fleeting, and too vague to give you concrete information. Further, the phenomenon of deja vu is sometimes just caused by a memory of a movie or, it is triggered by a similarity your current circumstances have to something forgotten from childhood. However, if you spend more time around the triggering factor, you might find yourself gradually beginning to unearth more and more memories of a past life. So, remain open to what deja vu may be trying to tell you. 2. Unusual memories. One of the most common signs of past lives is unusual memories. These can crop up at any time and may be more detailed than those associated with the feeling of deja vu. For example, you might notice that there's something unusual about these memories when you check them against the memories of others and find there's no overlap. This is particularly common with things you might think happened when you were young, but which your family swears never occurred. Of course, there's always the potential for this to simply boil down to faulty memory or even to a daydream that you had in childhood and then encoded as real. 
to tell whether the real memories of past lives, look for things you can check in reality but couldn't have known about, such as specific landmarks, people, or fine-grained details of a place. This process will give you a way to differentiate between reality and fantasy. 3. Dreams and Nightmares Past life regression experiences often occur in your sleep, manifesting in vivid dreams or nightmares that stick with you long after you wake. In the case of nightmares, you may sometimes be recalling traumas experienced in your past lives. For example, things that have been difficult to live through, and that still need further processing. Meanwhile, you might repeatedly dream of a person you have never met, who could well be an important figure who is now long dead. As with apparently significant memories, it's important to look for little details that may seem mundane and yet hold the key to understanding the life you used to live. In particular, look out for signs of where you might have lived, and try to note down everything you remember when you wake. With a little bit of research, you can begin to narrow your past life down to a specific country, town or occupation. 4. Fears and Phobias When thinking about how to remember past life memories, your mind may not immediately go to the idea of phobias. However, these seemingly fears and discomforts can actually be links to old experiences from previous lives, so take note of them. Some phobias are extremely common and are therefore less likely to be linked to past lives. Examples of such fears include fear of heights, medical procedures, snakes, sharks, and spiders. All of these relate to a basic desire to survive. In contrast, the types of phobias that could indicate past lives include irrational and highly specific fears. Think of water, a particular number, a shape, an object, and so on. Notice if any of these fears link up with any dreams or memories that you've already connected to a past life. For example, you might both fear water and regularly dream that you are drowning in one location. 5. Passions. On a nicer note, it's important to be aware that past lives can lead to positive and satisfying experiences, not just fears, nightmares, and confusing memories. One of the best signs of a past life connection is a strong, unshakable passion that shapes who you are. Here, we're not simply thinking of things that you like to do in your spare time. Rather, the focus is on passions that you can't resist, and that feel as necessary to you as breathing. There are countless of examples of how these types of passions might manifest, but they're often creative. So if you can't live without music, can't go a day without writing or are always saving up for new painting supplies, you may have had an associated occupation in your past life. And with such creative pursuits, you might also see aspects of your past lives emerging in your work if you just let your creativity flow freely. 6. Uncontrollable habits. We all have tics and habits that are hard to explain. However, some of these can be a result of past life experiences. Once again, as with passions, the ones to take note of are the ones that you can't control. In particularly difficult cases, these habits might even become obsessions and can be problematic in daily life. Obsessive compulsive behaviors are relevant here, though of course they might also be linked to traumas and anxieties that you developed in this life. Think, too, of little habits that you need in order to feel comfortable. For example, an object you need close by, a ritual you have for relaxation, a physical thing that you do in order to calm down. For each of these, think about what might explain them in your recent history. Where you can't find an explanation, look for links between the habits and your other information about potential past lives. 7. Inexplicable pain. It goes without saying that all unexplained pain should be thoroughly investigated by medical professionals. Many diseases and conditions are hard to uncover and may require a long-winded diagnosis of exclusion. However, if your doctors have exhausted all possible explanations for a type of pain that you have, don't dismiss the idea that your discomfort could be linked to past life experiences. An obvious example here is an ache that relates to an injury you sustained in a previous life or one that you may have experienced as part of surgery or childbirth. Add this pain to the picture you're building of your past life, and notice any further clues that might explain it. 
If, say, you often have an unexplained sore leg and you also repeatedly dream of running, perhaps you used to be an athlete, a soldier, or someone who was injured when being chased. 8. Birthmarks. Finally, one of the major physical past life signs and symbols is a birthmark. Many of us have one or more of these, and we often just dismiss them as insignificant. They can be caused by our position in the womb, our birth, or random patterns of pigment. However, people studying the nature of reincarnation have often wondered if these marks might constitute concrete evidence for past lives. In fact, there are documented cases of discovering images that show the same marks on other people. There are two ways in which your birthmarks might be linked to reincarnation. Firstly, they might be passed on through a series of lives, and, if prominent, may provide you with a way to look for images of yourself in previous existences. Secondly, they might relate to an injury in an old life. You might have a pink or brown mark where you were hurt in one of your previous lives. Do you want your life to be better and better? Do you want your finances to be stable? Do you want to find an ideal lover? I believe that you always want to have both career and love. Have you found solution yet? We already have the answer for you. All the answers are for you. Click on the link in the description below my video. Click here, show more. To see more details description. All you need is here. Subscribe to our channel, you'll be the first to receive the latest video, and click on the link in the description below the video to find your own answer. I believe the valuable answer will change your life. That's the end of today's video. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment. If you find it interesting, bye, and see you again in the next videos.